children made their way back in. So I invite any of the children in the congregation that would like a closer seat for the baptism to come forward and sit out front here. But make sure we leave space for our two families right here in the middle. If anybody wants to come forward and take a seat, maybe right here. How about that? All right. All right. Welcome back. Okay, we're making sure we leave a room right in the middle for our two families to get through, okay? Did you guys have a good Sunday school? Yeah. All right. What did you guys talk about? Two pictures, God is love. That is absolutely true. Absolutely true. So we're getting ready. Oh, man. We, we got lots of you here, so we can put a lot more on this side. We just need to make sure. I do. I do. Oh, it's good to have you guys here. Do you want to sit over this way so we can leave that room in the middle? All right, Xander. How about we slide there? Perfect. Perfect. How's it going? Man, this is awesome to see all of these children. It makes it hard to leave that space in the middle, but it's awesome to see you all. We are so glad you guys are here to watch this baptism. All right. So, when, uh, Aaron, I'm going to put you in charge of when, when the families need to go. You're going you're gonna to clear that front, front area, all right, for me? All right. So uh, I invite you all to stand, our baptismal candidates. Those parents, you got there? The candidates for holy baptism will now be presented. I present. I present Lucas Spencer Dunham. Carter Andrew Sikorsky. To receive the sacrament of baptism. Will you be responsible for seeing that the child you present is brought up in the Christian faith and life? I will, with God's help. Will you, by your prayers and witness, help this child to grow into the full stature of Christ? I will, I will with God's help. Do you renounce Satan and all the spiritual forces of wickedness that rebel against God? I will I renounce them. Do you renounce the evil powers of this world which corrupt and destroy the creatures of God? I renounce, I renounce them. them. Do you renounce all sinful desires that draw you from the love of God? I, I renounce them. Do you turn to Jesus and accept him as your Savior? I do. Do you put your whole trust in his grace and love? I do. Do you promise to follow and obey him as your Lord? I do. I do. Will you who witness these vows do all in your power to support these persons in their life in Christ? We will. Let us join with those who are committing themselves to Christ and renew our own baptismal custom. Do you believe in God the Father? I believe in God the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. Do you believe in Jesus Christ the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. believe in God the Holy Spirit. Deliver them, O Lord, 
from the way of sin and death. Lord, hear our prayer. Open their heart to your grace and truth. Lord, hear our prayer. Fill them with your holy and life-giving spirit. Lord, hear our prayer. Keep them in the faith and communion of your holy church. Lord, hear our prayer. Teach them to love others in the power of the spirit. Lord, hear our prayer. Send them into the world and witness to your love. Lord, hear our prayer. Bring them to fulfillness, fullness of your peace and glory. Lord, Lord, hear our prayer. Grant, O Lord, that all who are baptized into the death of Jesus Christ, your Son, may live in the power of his resurrection and look for him to come again in glory, who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. I'm making sure it comes before the water works. All right. Aaron, you're in charge of making room there. Lucas, receive the light of Christ.
Carter, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. You are sealed by the power of the Holy Spirit and marked as Christ's own forever. Amen. Carter, receive the light of Christ. forgiveness of sin, and have raised them to the new life of grace. Sustain them, O Lord, in your Holy Spirit. Give them an inquiring and discerning heart, the courage to will and to persevere, a spirit to know and to love you, and the gift of joy and wonder in all your works. Amen. Let us welcome the newly baptized. We receive you into the household of God. Confess the faith of Christ crucified, proclaim his resurrection, and share with us in his eternal priesthood. The peace of the Lord be always with you. And also with you. 